Same coverage takes us now to Broward County, where the rush for supplies is also on. No word on evacuations yet, but as we mentioned earlier, classes have been canceled for Thursday and Friday. CBS 4's Hank Tester is outside a Costco store in Pembroke Pines with more. Broward residents taking preparations for Hurricane Irma seriously. Out in force today, hunting down gas, a major issue. Well, it's never too early to uh, prepare for Irma. It's a Category 5 storm. We're very concerned. There's been a run on gasoline all day long in Broward County. For some folks, it's going to be too late. This station, out of gas. And water, the essential hurricane preparedness staple. Lots of water going out the door at this Costco. Merchants hustling to restock. Were you able to find everything? Uh, no, they didn't run out of water, unfortunately, but I keep looking. But you got batteries? Batteries, and... some lights. Are you, gonna, are you gonna come back tomorrow for Yeah, water? they said tomorrow that we have it at 9 a.m., so I stand in line like everybody else. Broward public officials in action, making a swift decision about school. Given the severity of this storm and, um, and an abundance of caution and to give our parents and our community um, sufficient time to adequately prepare, uh, we will be suspending and closing schools on Thursday and Friday. So far, Broward not pulling the trigger on evacuations in flood-prone areas, but discussions ongoing. We are here because Hurricane Irma is a very large and powerful Category 5 storm. Broward County officials are closely monitoring it, and we're asking that our residents do the same. So it's hurry up and wait, then come back tomorrow. Hurricane Irma lurking, Category 5. I'm Hank Tuster, CBS 4 News.